how to apply a motion blur effect to each of the strands in this image in Photoshop. Go to filter and blur and motion blur and it doesn't work. You think, no, what's gone wrong? I want it along that, I want it along there. Well, you can go to filter, blur gallery and path. Path blur. Now, unfortunately, the default effect doesn't take into account all these strands, but what you can do, just go here, click there, and just drag it along that strand, all the way along, over to there, and then you can go to the center point and just drag it like that. You've got this little plus. Just click, and you can add another one. And again, go all the way along, and you can add as many points as you want. Maybe go out further, so it's just twisting upwards. To stop, just press Escape. And then you go to this strand. You don't have to start from the center, so you can go from here, there, up there, and there. Again, escape, maybe that one. Escape, click on the document again, add some more points. Escape, and then just go down here, and then go around there. Just loosely follow the line. And again, finally, this one. And escape. And you can see now the motion blur is along those different strands. You can also go over here to the blur tools. There's a variety of different options, but I'm just gonna go for this one, speed. So you can increase the speed. So you can make it zoom out each of those strands in those different directions. And you can modify it, taper as well. And if you want, use edit blur shapes to modify it even further. Once you're happy with it, click okay. And there's your end result. Now, of course, you can add additional effects to it. You can also go to image adjustments, maybe levels, or maybe just use auto tone and create all kinds of unique designs.